Hey guys, welcome to the studio. Today I'm going to show you how to set up your Raspberry Pi 3 to mine cryptocurrency. Keep in mind that because we're using such a tiny device, profits will be marginal, but it's a great way to get started. With that said, let's get started. I'm going to link the commands I typed in the description, but um, open up your SSH client or on your Raspberry Pi. You're going to want to type in sudo apt-get update. And let that do its thing. Okay, after that, you're gonna to want to type in sudo apt get upgrade. Now, during both these commands, it may ask you to update something, so you're gonna to want to press yes, y, enter. And once that's done, it may ask you to reboot. You're gonna to want to do that as well. Now, in order to install the miner, we need to install a few dependencies. Um, I'm going to have this link in the this command in the description, but you're going to want to copy and paste this into your client or your Raspberry Pi. And now it might ask you to type in Y for yes to install. You're going to want to do that again. All right, now that all of that's done, we can finally install our CPU miner. For that, we're going to need to copy and paste this, git clone, we're going to clone this uh, GitHub project, press enter, and uh, let that download and uh, copy the files to your directory. Once that's done, we're going to need to navigate to the directory it made, so type ls and you'll find cpu miner dash multi. So we're going to type in cd cpu cpu miner dash multi, press enter. And from here, what we're going to type is dot slash build dot sh. Now, this is going to take some time, so be patient. And if it throws any weird errors or stuff, don't worry, it's just a part of the process. Okay, so now that we're done installing the CPU miner, let's just test it by typing in dot slash CPU miner. And as you can see, it's working right now, but we haven't really given anything, so we can close the thing with control C. To show you guys an example of how this works, I'm going to mine Dashcoin from a pool that I've already signed up for and that I've been using. Press enter. And as you can see, it's setting the difficulty and it's going to basically start mining at a very low hash rate, I believe, but it still works. Yeah, as you can see, it is uh, mining on all four CPUs with the Raspberry, not the CPUs, all four cores that the CPU has to offer on the Raspberry Pi. And uh, there you have it. If this video helped you, please be sure to like and subscribe. And if you have any comments, I will answer them as soon as I can. Peace.